Today's learning goal is I can read numbers. Hello again, everyone. So we talked about numbers yesterday, but mostly what is a number and what isn't a number. So we know one is a number and we know a triangle is not a number. So we are going to put away some of the shapes and the other things we are talking about and really talk about numbers. And today I want you reading numbers. It's like reading letters, reading a word, reading a book. We need to be able to read our numbers, even when they're not in order. So I'm going to start right now. Could you tell me what number is this? One. What's the next one going to be? What's this one? Two. What comes next? Three. I'm going to try and trick you. I'm going to skip two. Get ready. What's that number? Five. I went back. The one I skipped it was four. What's this one? Six. Seven. I'm going to skip again. What is this one? Nine. And the one I skipped was eight. And then we have 10. And we'll go in order for a bit. What's next? 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. And the last one is 20. So a lot of us might be able to count our numbers in order and know them if we go one, two, three, four, five, six. Today I do want you to practice reading them out of order. So I'm going to show something now on a computer screen and I'm going to point to different ones and I want you to tell me what they are out of order. And that's a great activity to practice again after on your own. And then the work today I'm just going to ask is please to look at some of the rhymes. Some of our counting rhymes and songs and practice them. And then tomorrow, we're going to talk about writing numbers. Let's go look at the numbers now. So here we have a number line at the top. It goes from 0 all the way to 20. And the numbers are in order to help us when we figure out what they are. I'm going to show you numbers now. And I want you to shout out what they are. And I'll see the answer afterwards to see if you're correct. But I'll wait a minute for you to yell it out first, okay? What's this first one? That's 1. One's two. And we've jumped ahead now. We have this number here. And if you don't know what it is, I'm going to show you a way to figure it out. And maybe you do, but this is a good strategy, a good way to find out. So we have this number here, and I can see it. I know that it's this one right here. If I can't remember what it is right away, I could just count and see. Let's count and go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, it's ten. So if you said ten, you were correct. Let's try some more. Shout them out. Five, seven, three, one's nine, eight, four, six, this one's bigger than 10 here. This one's one bigger. We have 11. I wonder what the next one will be. 12. And I've got one more large one coming. Let's see if you know this one. You know what this one down here is? It is 20. So if there were some numbers that came up that you weren't sure about, I really want you to practice those today because we really need to be able to read our numbers all the way from zero to 20, even when they're in the wrong order. Your job today, what I'd like you to do, is to listen to some of the songs that we have on a counting YouTube playlist. So it'll be videos, but they're all songs and rhymes to help you practice counting and saying your numbers. And the other thing I'm gonna have you do right now before I go, I'm gonna show you the same page again I'm not going to say any of them. I'm just going to show them. I want you to shout them out one more time for practice. Okay, here we go. Great work. Now remembering today's job is to go listen and watch some of the counting and number songs on the YouTube playlist. 
Enjoy your math.